hello, it's Penn here from the Chris Packet Project. Just thought I'd um, jump on and show you a little video regarding how to do your strips of four to send in to help us make more survival items quicker for a grid of four. So we'll start off with our clean crisp packets, cut open landscape way. We then overlap them with your baking paper, with your iron on two and a half setting. And it's literally a swipe like that. Okay. And we want grids of four. Doesn't matter what size packets, but we pre prefer these regular size packets because they're easier uh, to roll up. Our less fortunate community find it easier to roll them up. They're not so bulky. And we can use slightly smaller ones like this as well. You can either choose to do the whole thing with, say, smaller packets or just pop them on as long as they're straight at the one end and we just fuse it on like that and strips of four like this when you've done your strips of four fold them up yeah don't roll them because they're hard for us to put them together if they're rolled so just fold them like that and then pop them in an envelope or in a bag and then send them to HQ. The next stage you could do if you wanted to, you could make grids of four. So your four strips fused together to make a beautiful grid. This is great because we can get three of these to make one survival blanket. You can even put a little heart on it. You can also get a permanent marker and write a lovely message on the back of it. How to make a grid. You have four strips of four. Overlay it by the centimetre. Place your baking paper on top. Middle, left to right. Push your grid away. Get your next one. Remembering these grids are going to be placed inside two bits of plastic. So don't worry if there's a little gap here and there, okay? It's fine. Pushing it away, get your last strip, place it on. Always going in the centre. Using, using, using. If you've got a space at the end there, you could then just get another packet and just place it over the end. Like that. You could then fold them all up grid to four like this for instance and pop them in the post in a small box or plastic bag we thank you for your support so we can make our items quicker for our less fortunate communities around the uk and over in war zone areas thanks for your support